If you believe, we are incredibly lucky to be living in a place as beautiful as Colorado, then you probably already know how important it is for us to protect the places and the experiences that make this such a special place to live. Like watching the sun light up Mount Sopris after a snowfall. Like sitting by Lincoln Creek as the clear water whispers by. Like taking an early morning walk through the Garden of the Gods or catching a glimpse of a mountain goat and her kid on Mount Evans. Colorado Democrats believe that everyone is entitled to clean air and clean water and believe in protecting our public lands. The Republicans, not so much. Their first loyalty is to the titans of industry. As you probably already know, the EPA is overturning or rolling back 67 regulations protecting the environment, like the regula regulations that protect our mountain air from the methane emissions at oil and gas drilling sites, or the noise and water pollution that will occur if drilling operations begin on the 18,000 acres adjacent to Great Sand Dunes National Park that the BLM wants to lease to oil and gas exploration companies. Another wonderful experience that comes with living in Colorado is taking afternoon walks, small family-centric communities like Carbondale, where you get to know your neighbors, or taking evening strolls along Telluride's Colorado Avenue as the last light leaves the surrounding mountains. Colorado Democrats are fighting to protect and enhance livable communities like these. So if you believe the current anti-regulation Republican administration is undermining the things that we hold dear, then you know now is the time to act, to support Colorado Democrats who believe that everyone is entitled to clean air and clean water, who believe in protecting our public lands, who believe in safe, livable communities like Carbondale, where the whole town turns out for the 4th of July parade. Yet another experience that makes Colorado such a wonderful place to live are all of the recreation opportunities, like floating through fresh powder above Aspen, splashing down rapids on the Green River near Dinosaur, fishing in the cool waters of the Crystal River. Plus, right out the back door, there's hiking, horseback riding, golfing, even the opportunity to hop a a ride in a hot air balloon. Colorado Democrats believe in rewarding businesses that create jobs in Colorado and do what's right by their employees. Like the outdoor recreation industry is certainly doing by creating 229,000 jobs, generating $28 billion in consumer spending and $2 billion in tax revenue. And at the same time, creating wonderful experiences for Coloradans and glorious memories for our visitors. As you probably already know, the administration has just placed protective tariffs on imported products like steel, aluminum, solar panels, and washing machines, igniting a trade war with our global trading partners. For instance, as you probably already know, the tariff on solar panels put in place to placate well-connected solar panel manufacturers will protect the profits for companies and protect a couple of hundred manufacturing jobs for workers. And those are good things. But because it will raise the price on solar panels, the tariff threatens as many as 2,000 installation jobs here in Colorado. And if the trade war spreads unchecked, it will hurt our Colorado ranchers and farmers whose overseas sales will be hurt because they'll have to pay higher tariffs on their exports to foreign countries. Colorado Democrats believe that our economy should work for all who work hard and few work harder than our ranchers and farmers who grow the food that not only feeds us, but feeds the world. If you believe America's infrastructure, from highways to railroads, 
to harbors and to airports is critical for transporting Colorado goods to American and overseas markets, then you know that funds are desperately needed to maintain and upgrade those infrastructure facilities. But as you probably also know, the Republicans just passed a tax bill that added $1.5 trillion to the national debt, making it very difficult for Congress to budget money for the infrastructure projects needed here in Colorado. Colorado Democrats believe in managing our growth to maintain the Colorado way of life, and that means upgrading and modernizing our transportation and infrastructure facilities. And it means upgrading and modernizing our schools. As you probably know, the administration is proposing to cut $3.6 billion from the Education Department. Colorado Democrats believe that all children deserve a high-quality education, regardless of family income or their zip codes. If you believe that the Social Security, Medicare, and Medicaid programs that we've paid into our entire working lives are an earned portion of your retirement plans, then you probably already know that, according to Forbes magazine, it's not a question of if, but a question of when the Republican leaders in Congress are going to start blaming the $1.5 trillion budget deficit on our social programs rather than their tax cuts as a pretext for slashing Social Security, Medicare, and Medicaid. Please vote for Colorado Democrats who believe you have earned your retirement program and your medical insurance. If you believe we're facing a serious opioid crisis, then you probably know that according to this recent issue of Time Magazine, drug overdoses are now killing more people in one year than died in the 12 years of the Vietnam War. You probably also know that President Trump declared this situation an emergency, but he didn't allocate any funds for combating it, instead proposing that drug dealers face the death penalty. Colorado Democrats believe it is vital to emphasize prevention as well as punishment. And if you believe that the health care system needs an overhaul to increase the availability of care and to get medical costs down, then you probably already know that the Trump Care program that Republicans have cobbled together to replace Obamacare is projected to cost the government $33 billion more to cover 6.4 million fewer Americans than Obamacare. Colorado Democrats believe that every Colorado should have access to affordable health care and that no one should go broke because they get sick. And if you believe we are a great nation because we're a nation of immigrants, then you probably already know that there's a plaque at the base of the Statue of Liberty that reads, Give me your tired, your poor, your huddled masses yearning to be free. Send these, the homeless, tempest-tossed to me. I lift my lamp beside the golden door. You probably also know that the current administration is turning a blind eye to this cornerstone of our values and ordering ICE agents to separate mothers and fathers from their children by deporting individuals who have lived here, in some cases, for decades, who work at jobs where they're needed, who pay their taxes and contribute to their communities, individuals who have committed no criminal activities. We hope you will elect Democratic officials who will return our country to the welcoming values on which it was founded. And if you believe that it's wrong to deport the young DACA men and women from the only country they've ever known, then you know that these kids have been educated in the same classes as your kids, speak the lang same language, and have acquired the same values as your kids that they're using our investment in their education to make contributions that benefit all of us, just like the rest of the young Americans in their generation. Now is the time to vote for Colorado Democrats and elect people into local, state, and federal offices who believe that if you work hard, you deserve the opportunity.
to earn a good life. As you probably already know, we not only have to elect Democrats to national offices, we have to elect Democrats running for statewide offices like Secretary of State, Treasurer, and Attorney General, who sometimes don't get our votes because we don't know anything about them. Well, soon you will be able to go to the Colorado Democrats website to learn about these important candidates. And don't forget, we also have to vote for the Democrats running for city and county positions. They are the ones on the front lines protecting our Colorado way of life. If you believe we are one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all, then you probably already know that we have to stop the Republican Party from infecting this great nation with the narcissistic values of this me first president and his America first administration and vote for Colorado Democrats who are determined to rejoin the global community and return us to our place of global leadership. Colorado Democrats hope that you will join us to help create a gigantic blue wave that on election day will sweep across the country and return us to being a country founded on the principle that all people are created equal. Please get out and vote for Democrats in November and encourage your friends and neighbors to vote for the entire Democratic ticket. Let's take our country back so we can put people first. Colorado Democrats believe we have the power to change Colorado and the country for the better. Thank you.